opinions. <laughs> Uh, we love the duo behind Lexington's Backroads Bakery, two guys who know what they're doing. Their custom cheesecakes have quickly become a local favorite. They have such amazing flavors. They started out online, but now they have a storefront downtown. And they're branching out from just desserts. They're adding brunch to the menu. We stopped by to check it all out. Here we are at Backroads Bakery right off of uh, Limestone. That's weird, boys. Right. Well, I mean, I know this isn't your home, but every time you say back roads, I think, well, oh, good, we're going to go out into the country someplace. No, 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 right in downtown. Downtown, right? Yeah. The only bakery that's, like, in walking distance of everything down here. Let's talk about the sweets that we have in front of us as well. What do we have today? Uh, so we have uh, the Reese's Cup Cheesecake, which is probably <laughs> one of our most popular candy bar cheesecakes uh -huh. that we do. Uh, and then we are starting to do cupcakes. So we have our Snickers uh, Cupcakes, which has a Snickers in the center of the cupcake and then caramel icing. That's always my thing with what I've always done is there's nostalgic yeah. behind it. It's things I had as kids or things I wanted as a kid because I grew up in Eastern Kentucky, it was very poor, but I didn't get a lot of this stuff. So now as an adult, it's kind of nostalgic. It, we do what everybody else sees on Pinterest and they always wanted, but never done it, so. Oh, that's exactly yeah. right. Yeah, because literally this would be something you'd see on Pinterest and be like, I wish I could make that, but I know that I cannot. <laughs> so let them do it. All right, so this is an Oreo drip cake. It is an Oreo cake with Oreo buttercream, uh, chocolate ganache on top, and then there's an Oreo cake ball that looks like the top of the ice cream cone. I really like the lavender uh, the lavender honey cheesecake. Ooh. It's very springy, where it's not just like, you know, a cake dipped in lavender essential oil. Yeah, right. yeah that's true. That, yeah. It doesn't taste like a cough drop. Yeah. Yeah. So on Sunday, we're going to start doing breakfast. Uh, we're going to start having our biscuits, our gravy, and possibly move into other things like Pop Tarts and muffins and <gasps> stuff like that. Now do me a favor, Ben. As Charlie pours the gravy over the biscuits, I want you, in your slow and sexy voice, describe the ingredient. Sultry sausage. <gasps> oh. Fattening grease. Mm. Sexy flour. Mm. Mixed with some hot milk all stirred together. Mm. And you get gravy. A little salt and pepper in there. Oh this man. This is the first time I'm gonna eat biscuits and gravy with my shirt off. Oh. So I didn't rough. know you had it in you. Usually you bring a lot of good sweets to the table. I didn't know you could make savory things. But you rocked it. This is delicious. I, love this. I just want to eat the gravy as a soup. Is that frowned upon? No. Okay, good. So, so good. Guys, so delicious. It was. You can you've got to go try their brunch on Sundays. You can still order though their custom made desserts online from Backroads Bakery or go see them in store inside the bodega in downtown Lexington, 227 North Limestone. And visit backroadsbakerylex.com for more information.